We were going to be talking shop today with Dan Risley, president of ASA, but we're here in Anaheim, California, so forget it. I'm going to Disneyland. I'm Jacqueline with CCC, and we're talking shop today with Dan Risley, president of ASA, about the new NACE cars here in sunny Anaheim, California. Let's go meet him. Dan, thank you so much for being with us today. You're welcome. Excited to be here in beautiful Anaheim, California. Um, so I want to jump right in. Anaheim this year, it's a new location for NACE. Can you tell us a little bit about what else has changed? Aside from the fact that we're here in the sun and under palm trees, a lot is different. We have never had the show anywhere further west than Las Vegas. This is our first time we're going to have it in California. So we have a new base of customers, new base of exhibitors. It's an exciting time for us for the show. Can't wait to see what's going to happen. Now, something else that's pretty significantly different for us is our general session. We've made a decision that we want to give the exhibitors and the attendees what they want, that's more networking time. We're going to host a welcome reception before the show begins on Wednesday night, free to all attendees. And if you look over my left shoulder, that's exactly where it's going to take place. It's going to be in the Grand Plaza. And I'm really happy to announce that it's going to be sponsored by the car manufacturers. So they're bringing 20 vehicles to the show floor. They're going to be bringing vehicles here on the Grand Plaza. So while you're having a cocktail, as you're enjoying some hors d'oeuvres, you're enjoying some live music, you're going to get to see some of the newer vehicles that are going to be on display and perhaps maybe even a few NASCARs. Ford came to us and said, hey, look, we want to do something really neat for your show. We want to bring in the 2017 Super Duty line. So there's a ride and drive demo in the back of the show floor. So see it, touch it, drive it. In addition to that, you're going to see the new Audi QR7. You're going to see the all aluminum Cadillac CT6. You're going to see new vehicles that you would be repairing in your shop today. And then, of course, we're going to intersperse that with some antique vehicles, some local vehicles from some of the more famous people here locally, one of which is John Force Racing. We'll have a couple of his vehicles on display on the show floor as well. Our show isn't about the antique vehicles or the custom vehicles, but we know that our attendees like to see those things, so we want to make sure that they're there for them. So I know this year you're going to have some co-located events, and you've done that in the past, but what's different this year? We want it to be an industry show, and the way we do that is by having co-located events. So this year we'll have over 12, the California Auto Body Association, the Assured Performance OEM Certification Symposium, and the Automotive Service Council of California are having board meetings and having conferences during the show. So that really should bring in some new local traffic that our exhibitors haven't seen before. So Anaheim is an amazing city. Can you tell us what the city has to offer for fun? Disney's obviously a big attraction, but you also have things such as the Knott's Berry Farm, Universal Studios, beaches, Rodeo Drive, Hollywood, downtown LA. And if you're feeling very ambitious, go to San Diego, which is just a short two hour drive away, I would recommend going. Dan, thank you so much for having us. My pleasure, Jacqueline. It's uh, always great to be here with you. It's a great time for us. It's really a good venue, and we think the exhibitors and attendees are going to absolutely love Anaheim. Us too. We'll see you back in August. Sounds good. That's all the time we have for today. If you have an idea for Talk and Shop, send it to us at cccis.com slash talk and shop. Maybe next time we'll be talking shop with you. I'm going to Disneyland.